What's going on guys, it's Danny here, leveling a panda and monk, episode 15, let's go. Look at that helm though, that helm though, we got it from the dungeon we did at, at the end of the previous episode. Oh yeah, and then the, the potion that's making us undead, we're going to be a uh, undead monk for like an hour. So... The first thing, let's go here and let's complete the training real quick and get the bonus experience from quests. Let's do that. The Pandaren zone. Who's laughing like that? <laughs> and then we're going to start a bar fight. Remember previous episode, we bought the bottle and everything was ready just need to go and start the fight yes. we're going to start a bar fight between wheel. that gnome and um what's the other one the, the gnomes and um goblins why do i keep forgetting it in the previous episode it was the same i i have like i forget the name goblin this little green people all right, you are the master, Master Cheng. All right, the mists protect you. I challenge you, Master Cheng. Let's go. Let's see what happens when we start the bar fight. I'm wondering what's going to happen. Can't wait. <laughs> the start a bar fight. So, in the previous episode, we did a battleground. It was really, really fun. Maybe we can queue for another one right now and do some PvP and fight against the Alliance. It's Sunday, I'm recording this on Sunday, um, almost 3 p.m. At this, at this time there should be a lot of people playing and it should be faster to find a, a battleground a group, faster than before. Let's go man, Jesus, it's taking forever for you to fight me. Look at the undead. How the undead is kicking. Undead monk is not bad either, man. Whoa, 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 whoa. What is this fire, man? Wait a second. I'm gonna heal myself. This training might get... Um, might get harder later. In the, in, the, in the higher levels. Because I have never seen that AoE fire before. He wasn't doing this before. Okay then. Welcome. I hope you got the quest. And um What did I get? Oh yeah, only the buff. No no items from the quest. R return. Let's see if we return in the exactly same s in the exactly same place where we were before. If not, I have the hearthstone in the bar. Exactly in the bar where we have the quest. I have the hearthstone there. Uh, okay, we returned pretty close to it. Not gonna use the hearthstone. Maybe I would need it a bit later or something. I don't know. Let's roll. Nine minutes average wait time for the battleground. Hmm. I wish it was a bit... A bit faster. <laughs> Whoa, 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 wait, 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 over here, over here. This potion, by the way, if you didn't watch the previous episode or something, or if you don't remember, um, this potion that makes us look like an undead, um, it's from the dungeon. In the previous episode, at the end, we did a dungeon. No loitering. So, after killing the last boss... It gave me this potion. It make me look... This is how the last boss looked like. Right now we are looking exactly like the last boss. And I remember... Before it was another gnome here. It was male. Now it's female and... They are dancing still. Why are they still dancing? What is this quest even? I don't know. Um, let's start the bar fight. Where is the bottle? This is the bottle. So let's go and use it. 
Holy shit! <laughs> Holy shit! All right, guys. Um, guys, I didn't do anything. Um, sorry, but I have to leave right now. I have work to do. Uh, it wasn't me, guys. I totally did not start that fight. You not me. me. Hey, I got your back. <laughs> Big shot. Let's repair real quick. And then sell stuff that we don't need. I don't need anything actually from here. Can't sell the trinket because it's created. Um, there are quests. I see quests up here. So I do have more quests. What level are we? Level 43? What's on level 45? Uh, this zone over here. Okay, I've been in this zone. Level 45 to 50. Okay. But first, we need two more levels for that zone. Don't waste my um, time. Get a river boat. Okay. I will do Take that. Uh, whoa, whoa. Why is everything on fire right now? Are we leaving the boat? We're leaving the boat, aren't we? Because everything is on fire now. It's probably because of the bar fight. Is everything on fire because of the bar fight we started? <laughs> Holy shit. Alright, let's the word on the street? get me into my boat. Yes, please. Oh, damn, my boat looks pretty cool, actually. Alright. Look at everything around. The other boats, the mountains over there. Everything's so cool. Oh, wait, we have to do something. We have to kill stuff. Target needs to be in front of you. Okay, in front of me. Like this. Wait, what? Fire's extinguished. Oh, we have to... F we have to... Okay. Yeah, stop the fire on the boat. Jesus. And I'm trying to freeze these guys. <laughs> I'm trying to freeze the people in the bottle. Uh, in the In the boats. Okay, another fire extinguished. Ex extinguished. Extinguished. Another one over there. Okay. Another one here. Did we make it? Nope. Over there? Nope. Here? Yep. Nice. Another one here. Okay. Come on, man. Okay. Sometimes it's just at the edge of the boat and you don't even know. You don't know if you're making it. See, at the edge. Okay, here. 10 out of 15. 11. Need just 3 more. Maybe at one point there will be a, some kind of a quest to do something with these boats. Because I don't know what are these boats and the people on them. One more, guys. Okay, done. Did I just get another quest? I got another quest. Fire the cannon at the south... South Sea borders rowboats these ones I just said that yep I just said that I knew we we're going to have a quest with these guys so we have to kill them see ya motherfuckers see ya when is my pvp ready I wanna go into a battleground and kill some alliance players I wouldn't mind the battleground we played yesterday. Yesterday I played that battleground for the first time. Don't even remember what it's called. But that was my first time and that was a really fun battleground. I don't mind any battleground but... 
Um, that one was pretty fun. I would like to repeat. Repeat. Use the, uh, use the leave vehicle button. Okay. This one, yeah. What the hell? Oh, okay. Well, boat is saved, guys. But um, people are panicking here. What's with all the people and all the panic? Yo, relax, guys. It's just fire, guys. Go, go. It gives me gloves for for intellect, but we don't use intellect. We are not a healer. And this one, summon your river boat on the water surface within 20 yards. Oh, I have my own boat. Yep, I I told you. Go, go. I told you there has to be something like this in this zone. I'm gonna put it in here. We don't have to lose it. And I'm actually going to put it ne right next to the mount. And now don't we have a lot time. of quests to do. Yep, what you want? Who am I getting dueled? Getting dueled by a paladin. Yeah, what do you want? Okay, paladin. You want fight? Okay, I think we can. Maybe we can. Holy shit, I'm stunned. Okay, I have the trinket. Need to heal myself. She can hear herself, heal herself too, can she? Oh, I can't interrupt that. She has the buff that stops me from interrupting it. But I kill her anyway. Yeah, bitch. What's up? I am a monk. Let me try again, he says. I fly away with the flying serpent kick. And then I heal myself. And then I have the key torpedo too. Oh, she's gonna change specialization. She changed to um, another specialization. Another talents. Retribution. She changed to this. Oh, she actually might beat us now. Okay, you want again? I will give you again. Alright. I can't attack that target. Well, this time I don't have the trinket for the stun, so I can't remove the stun. Which sucks. We actually might lose this time. I interrupted the heal! Yes! <laughs> we won! We won, boys! Interrupted the heal. Almost. This time, uh, this time she didn't use the buff. I think she has a buff that... Uh, uh, I can't interrupt the spells, but this time I could interrupt the heal, and I did interrupt it. See ya. <laughs> Goodbye, bitch. <laughs> two duels. Two duels, two wins. Oh, we the best, guys. We are the best at the dueling stuff. In before, I get... Uh... In before, I start liking a doing a lot of PvP. And I turn from PvE to PvP player. <laughs> nah, that's not gonna happen. I don't know. I, I will do both. I mean, I always like doing both. And this is the silver... Silver shard mines. 
the first time playing this battleground um, no idea what to do there is a minecart I see but what do you do on the minecart we will see we will figure out let's go baby oh no my buff expired uh, I don't look like an undead anymore you know my my buffed my buff as an undead expired when I entered the battleground shit okay this is the boat what do we have to do on the not the boat but the cart let's kill some people actually fuck the cart <laughs> Maybe the, the real objective of the game is to kill people, not the card. And do nothing on the card. Hey, guy, where are you going? Where are you trying to go, brother? Brother man, Bill, where are you going? Why is he so tanky? Somebody help me kill this guy, man. It's taking forever to kill him. Okay, he's healing people. He's healing himself and others. And he's getting healed by other people. Okay, I have to kill the I have to kill the fucking healers first. But first I wanna know what do you do with the card? Do you just go together with the card? And then automatically the card is like horde? There is an alliance player next to the card. Yo, what are you doing there, bro? What are you doing here, brother? Hey, brother. What? They captured the card, didn't they? The Alliance has taken control of a mine card. So you basically have to stay close to the card, so you make it yours. When I'm close to the card, it's Horde. Right now the card looks Horde, it's red. So we have to stay next to the card and capture it. And and the card goes to the the card goes to the end. What a fun battleground actually. This is one really fun battleground. I don't want to be the person who just stays next to the card all the time. Okay, this guy, I'm going to leave this guy with the card and I'm going to go fight for another card. It's a lot fun. It's a lot more fun when you have to fight for the card. And these guys, these guys are not noticing me. I'm gonna take it. It's mine now, right? Okay, not yet. Okay, it's a horde card now. Nice. So we have one here and one here. We have two cards going for us an enemy has one so they will capture one we capture two okay it's good how am i gaining so much experience i'm gaining crazy amount of experience right now i mean it's good i want to level up but okay the other card please deliver the card oh shit what is this guy yo what do you want from us? We are just capturing the card. <laughs> See ya. You can loot their body. You can right click to loot their body. Um, okay. This card will be delivered, right? It's just a little bit left. We need to go and take the other card. I'm gonna go help. There are two people with this card. We don't have to be there anymore. Now we have to be here and secure this one. Some of the cards have really short path. Some of them have to go from here to here. But others like this one, they have to go all the way around here until the end. If they have to travel more distance, they better give more experience and more points. So we can win the battleground. It makes sense. Travel more distance, give more exp give more points to us. 
Okay, we gotta get this guy out of the cart. This guy is annoying on the cart. I like how not many people are bothering me. In the previous battleground, everyone was like focusing me nonstop for some reason. For some reason, everyone hated me in the previous battleground. I need to heal myself really, really fast. We're actually going to die because um, everyone is dead from, from the horde players. We are the only horde left here. So we're gonna die. And they will take the card too. Uh, they took it at the end. Just at the end they took it. Shit. Okay, we're going for this one. So basically what you have to do, the card starts here in the middle and then the card goes to this one, this one or this one over here. So you have to control the cards, you have to stay next to them and have control of them. Heal Alliance players if they are there controlling it. Oh, this guy used immunity. He has the immunity thingy. Come on, kill him. He's very tanky. This is a tank. But it's not impossible to kill if we focus him with everyone. Alright, let's go, boys. Oh, here, guys. Below the map. This is, this is when you take the card. You don't take the card immediately. You have this uh, bar going to the left side for Alliance and right side for Horde. Yeah, makes sense. Okay, so this is delivered, right? This is the end here. Let's go for another one. It goes in, right? Yeah, okay. Um, Where are we going? Where are we going? Let's go for that one. There are people there. The best thing to do is probably to have uh, assign people. You can do more serious PvP when you get like level 110. And then there are guilds that do a lot of PvP. There are PvP guilds and uh, PvE guilds dedicated for that. And just like you do raids um, for, for like dungeons and raids, you can also have pre-made groups. They are called pre-mates or just raids as well for battlegrounds. And uh, when everything is more organized, in this battleground in particular, you probably have... Oh my god, they took all three of them. What the fuck just happened? When everything is more organized... Yeah, I'm too late. Not gonna happen. Shit. You probably... Um, probably have like a good distribution of people or whatever like four people on one card four people on another card and stuff like that i don't know we need to take that one that one is neutral we need to have more people to control it but people are not fighting on the card people are fighting be below be before the card are we taking it or what's happening here? We're not taking it, we're losing it. Yeah, we lost it. We're gonna lose the battleground, dude. What do you want from me? I interrupt your casts, annoying warlock. How is she draining so much HP for me? Yeah, die! Die, Warlock! <laughs> okay. Alliance wins, right? Ah, shit. How many kills we had? Killing blows and damage done and stuff like that. Not bad. Okay, so we lost this one. 
1,500. This battleground was really, really nice. Take the cards, take control of the cards. Level 44 and already have the starting quest. The, the beginning of the, the starting quest for, for the next level zone. How do you say this exactly? Is it like Tan... Tanaris? Tanaris. Tanaris? Okay. Tanaris. <clears throat> but first I want to do these quests. I want to quest here until level 55, uh, 45. And I want to test the boat. I have my own boat right here. Yep, look at that. Let's go. It's so much better than swimming. I told you in the previous episode, there has to be something. Some kind of a buff that makes you run on top of the water or give you some, some kind of a special mount for the zone. Just like this one. Whoa, whoa, this is alliance thing here? Alliance players? Alliance boat? Yo, let's go kill some alliance players, man. Where is she going? No! Wait for me! <laughs> Wait! Wait for me! Actually, nah, we're just gonna quest. I think just questing is the best idea. Uh, let's queue for a dungeon. Let's go for a... For a... Um, a random dungeon. How much time? Four minutes. Av average wait time. Four minutes. Great. Have a target. Okay, one out of 15. So we have to kill 15 of these. I would like to go to a place where there are more than... 15. And then we have to destroy the cannons. Kill the kill these guys and destroy the cannons. Okay, we're gonna do that. That's easy. Destroy the cannon and kill these guys. Kill this guy. Destroy cannon. I am out of breath. I can go through something again. Um, I'm doing it in like a lot of the episodes, but but it it's not like I'm not doing it for a long time. I'm not going through it a lot. Why are we dizzy right now? Why is my camera shaking? Seven out of eight. Need to kill more of this. I can go through the abilities real quick again. Even though, you know, guys, um, the people who who have been watching since the very beginning, when we were getting the abilities or, or the spells one by one slowly from every episode. So, basically, we don't have so many right now. On my main character, that's level 110, I have... All the bars, like these two slots, I have spells everywhere here. And also I have on the extra bars on top, I have spells everywhere and stuff. But I get, I guess we're going to learn more spells a bit later when we level up more. What did, what did we get for level 44 though? Because in the battleground we got 44. Um, we unlocked another dungeon. Zulfarak, I guess. And that's it, nothing else. Just the dungeon. Bird. So, the first spell, Tiger Palm. Um, first of all, monks have energy on the top left. Energy. And then below, it's key. So, one consumes energy and creates key. It deals damage, of course. Two consumes key and deals a lot of damage. This is the strongest spell we have right now on two. Consumes two key and deals crazy damage. On three, it's a slow. 
I use it mostly battlegrounds. I don't use it on normal mo mobs when I'm doing quests or anything. I use it only in battlegrounds. It slows basically, slows by 50%. That's it. Movement speed slow by 50%. Why are we so dizzy like this? Oh, increased agility by 50. Look at that. And when, incre when agility is increased, basically it's also damage increased. Why is the camera just, you know, shaking a little bit? And where is the quest guy? Is the quest guy over here somewhere? Oh, there he is. Hey, what's up, man? Careful out there. Um, treasure chest. Okay, let's go and collect the treasure chest. Are we drunk or something? We must be drunk or something. I don't understand. When you you have the option, see, for example, this strong alcoholic whatever. When you drink it, your camera starts moving in weird directions and you feel dizzy and stuff. But why is it happening? I didn't drink anything right now. Jesus, man. It's a bit annoying, I mean. It's a little bit annoying, you know. But whatever. Let's go. We got the boat. Um. So, yeah. Disable uh, number three. Slows the enemy, slows the movement speed by 50%. And this is where the quest is, so let's go for the quest. Four is a key torpedo. Basically, you roll in front of your, if in front of you like this. And then it increases your movement speed for 10 seconds after the, after the torpedo is done. Where are the, where are the treasure chests? Okay, there is one over there. Uh, number five is a flying serpent kick. Another mobility spell. That it's the same like four, the same like the torpedo. You are not really you are not really rolling. You are like like flying in 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 the in the direction you're facing. Six is an AOE spell. Um, it consumes key. You need to you need three key and it's an aoe spell basically you you spin your character spins and you deal damage to everyone in eight yards f right here is the typical like the, the basic damage spell no any special effects just damage consuming one key because you will always have key for it. You use the key. The, the priority with the key, obviously, is for the second one. For the kick. And then you have this one. These people have already started. What is this dungeon? Have we done this dungeon before? How am I... How am I dead already in this dungeon? Okay, sometimes it's really awkward how you you join a dungeon that's already in progress and people are dying and people are leaving the dungeon. You don't know what's happening. Because clearly right now I need to run for my life. Haven't we done this dungeon before? Capital Gardens? I don't remember... Maybe we've done this dungeon before, I don't know. This is Dire Maul Capital Gardens. Okay, maybe we did another... Another version of it, not exactly this one. Where are my... Where is my group? Okay, here is. Here they are. Because I clearly need their help. I can't do this shit alone. This is probably a boss. This bear is a boss that's chasing me. And I'm gonna die. I am very close to dying. Okay. 
I think the perfect for me would be to start the dungeon since the very beginning. Because these people have already killed bosses. Because there are quests. This quest here, another quest here, that I probably won't be able to do because these people already did part of the dungeon. But then, you know what happens if I leave? I'm going to get a debuff here, um, not allowing me to join a, another dungeon for 30 minutes. And that's going to suck so much. So I'm actually going to take the quests and let's go. Let's go do the dungeon. Peace be with you. If I don't do every quest, it's no problem, I guess. Okay, let's see. Um, I didn't say about the R spell. Interrupt casts when you are doing a dungeon and the mob is... Oh, okay, the, the, the quest got completed. Complete. Completed. <laughs> Whatever. Um, R, the, the spear hand strike interrupts casts by enemy players or in the dungeon and mobs. V is a 2 minute cooldown, pretty powerful spell dealing a lot of damage, but 2 minute cooldown. And G I don't even remember anymore, I never ever use it. <laughs> Where exactly do I have to go? Where are these people? Okay, this guy, what's up man? This is the tank right here. Okay, let's follow the tank, hopefully he knows. Oh, he's going back for the quests. I could share the quests that I got. Okay, someone accepted the quest. And then... And then this one. And this one. How much are we into the video? 37 minutes. Okay. It's going to be enough to finish this dungeon. This dungeon seems to be kinda long. This dungeon has like... Uh, four bosses or something. Why did the tank leave the dungeon? And the healer left the dungeon too. <sighs> what is wrong with these people now? I honestly don't know where to go. Uh oh. Oh shit. These guys are really strong. I can't I can't fight them. But I can't run either. And there is another one. Okay, we got another tank and we got another healer. But I can't Okay, this way. This way seems to be clean. There are no mobs. Over here. Here. Probably this right here is stairs. Probably stairs that we can go on. I mean, this is a boss that they haven't killed. Isn't this the first boss of the dungeon? Which boss are you on? Uh, Tendris. Tendris. Warp wood. All right, we can finally get this going, right? I don't know the previous group, how much they killed and what have they done, but let's just finish it. 
in the dungeon says one out of one here and here so probably two bosses are down they probably did two bosses but let's kill this boss who is here the the healer the tank is not here the tank is over there and they are fighting against mobs okay what a disaster this dungeon okay they are coming finally they are coming let's go All right. Do, 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 do. Let's kill this guy. Big guy. Oh, he spawns other smaller trees. This is tree and protector from Dota. <laughs> we killed tree and protector, man. GG. This is a shield. We don't use shield. Even as a tank, still no shield. I need a tug. Okay, where are we going now? This way? Alright, this way. Okay, so now we are in a different zone. Yeah, probably that's the case. The people with the previous group killed two of the bosses. So now we have to kill the rest. We have to kill what's left of the dungeon. No problem, I mean. As long as I get the last boss and it says dungeon complete and it gives me the bonus experience from the dungeon finder and it gives me the bag so I can get a cool item or something, we happy with that. By the way, on level 45, we are going to skill another talent. I need a talk. If we go here to the talents on level 45, we get another one. Let's see, let's see what are the, the three options when we get the level. What are the three options and what to skill. I will try to skill something that's the best for leveling and doing dungeons and stuff like that. I forgot about the kick. Not the kick, but the, the spin. I should do the spin a lot more. Do we have to kill everything around the boss so we can access the boss? I think we get access to the boss anyway. But if we kill more mobs of these, we are gaining more experience, so it's okay. Yesterday, um... Yesterday when I was doing a raid on my main, on my Shadow Priest, I had Monk DPS in my team. And basically I saw that he has his, he's using the same spells that we have right now, but there is one more. So in the later levels, maybe at level 80 or 90 or 100, I have no idea exactly when, maybe at 60, maybe it's not very late. We learn another spell that punches really, really fast. Like, the hero stands and goes like... Doo -doo 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 just really, really fast punches. So... In the future, there will we will have another DPS spell. And then it will be pretty much with that. Tiger Palm, Sunrising Kick, Blackout Kick. When I get this to level 110, which won't happen very fast, this is slowly. I'm leveling up this character only when I'm recording. 
but when I get it to 110, I might do some uh, PvE with it. Might go to dungeons and stuff and try to get gear. I am try to get good items and shit. I mean, when I get 110, I'm definitely not deleting the character. You don't just delete a character that you spend time leveling up. We will see what exactly we're going to do with it. And we will see if we want to start another series leveling up another class. Um, and another race and class. Or, I don't know. We will see. But for now, for the moment, I'm glad that you are enjoying this. So far, and that's what matters. We have to kill the ice. He spawns some kind of ice. They probably deal damage, so we need to kill them. This eye right here. Okay, it's dead. Dungeon complete. Neck? Do we have a neck? Oh yeah, we do have the one that scales. The leveling gear. Um, there is one boss left. The prince... The prince Thortheldrin or whatever. Let's go. Let's go kill him. Strength, stamina and dodge. This is for... This is for tanking. This is a tanking ring. Not for us. We are DPS. Alright. Okay. We have only one completed quest from the dungeon. Hmm. I would like to do all of them, but then again, they are probably for the bosses that are already dead. I don't know. Yeah. I like how Pander and Monk looks like, man. I like the Monk in general. They are melee DPS, melee fighters. Using punches and kicks. The other uh, melee DPS um, classes in the game. They mostly... Oh, this is a nice wrist. And it's an upgrade to the one that we have right now. So let's get it. The other melee DPS uh, classes like Rogue, Warrior, Paladins and stuff. They all use some kind of a weapon. But Monks still have weapons, but they don't use them. They have the, the, the fist weapons, you know. That would be the perfect weapon. The fist weapon. Because right now the swords we are just carrying them on the back and not using them because we do it do it with punches. Okay, so are we done with the dungeon? What is this over here? Aren't we done with the dungeon? Maybe not. <laughs> Maybe there is more. I have so many quests at this point. Look at this shit. I don't even know what's going on. You definitely want to organize things. Okay, I don't know where we're going, but let's see. I'm pretty sure the dungeon we are ready with the dungeon. And this right here is nothing. We can't go. It said dungeon complete. So
No bosses. Bye bye. There are no bosses left. Dungeon is complete. And at the same time we have the option to join another dungeon. But we won't do that. Let's finish the quest we were doing here. The, um, the treasure chest. So I went through some of the spells in general. Um, we have been playing only as a DPS so far. If I switch specialization to tank or healer, for sure we will see spells that we haven't seen before. But I'm just gonna stick to DPS. In World of Warcraft you have one main specialization. And then you can have a secondary one, of course. Every class has three specializations. According to what you're doing. Some of them, like some classes, have specializations for DPS and tank and healer. Others like mage. The mage can be only a, a DPS. The mage cannot tank or heal. So the three specializations are like different. Fire is the best for PvE right now. Um, fire, yeah. Frost is for PvP for sure. And then the third one for mages is Arcane. I don't know what Arcane is very good for, but I know fire is for, for PvE. I used to have a fire mage before. Before I had a two, a two characters that I was playing a lot with. One of them is my, my main, my Shadow Priest, and then I also had a mage. Because before I was completely in love with, uh, deep, with uh, ranged DPS spellcasters. I, I was not playing a melee DPS like, like the monk. Only ranged DPS casters. Can I go on the boat somehow? How do I get on the boat exactly? Okay, over there. Right here. <laughs> I mean, I can't swim on that. Okay, so there is a quest here to return. And there is another quest here to return. Oh my god, I forgot to return the quest. Before I left the dungeon. I shouldn't have clicked leave dungeon, like leave group. I should have teleported out and then teleport in again. Quickly, anyway. Quickly. We're gonna get uh, level... Level 45 right now. After completing the next quest, we're getting level 45. Is it here? Yep. Makes sense. Let's go! Nice. So, level 45... Um, it's only the talent. Nothing else. Only the talent. So, level 45. The next one is at level 60. Damn. So long, be so, so long between uh, talents. Every 15 levels or something. Um, okay. Energizing elixir. Refilling all your energy and key. One minute cooldown. Okay, this is really cool. One minute cooldown. It refills all my energy and all the key. This is really nice, but let's see the others. Um, this one is, you have to activate it. If you choose it, you have to put it here. And then we use it. And see? I got full key right now, got five. Now, if we go for this one, this one is a passive. Increases your maximum key by one and your energy regeneration by ten. <sighs> energy regeneration by ten percent is really good. And having one extra key is really good too. 
And then the power strikes, the, the third talent that we can choose is a passive as well. Every 15 seconds, your next Tiger Palm generates one additional key. Every 15 seconds, the Tiger Palm, this is the spell we use probably the most. This is the very basic one. With this spell, we create key. So, every 15 seconds, it generates one additional key. Or do we want to have the number of key instead of 5, half a total of 6? And also the energy regeneration by 10%. Because I don't think we really need this. The 1 minute cooldown that... This, this seems really good for the maximum level when we are raiding and killing a, a boss that takes like 7 minutes or so. Or 10 minutes or whatever the boss takes. So every one minute you ha you can go full kiss. This seems like for last level PvE. Now we have to choose between the passives. I think this one. I think this passive is good. I'm going to choose this one actually. Yeah, one Tiger Palm generates two keys, two key, and then, and then we use those key for blackout kick or whatever. Yeah, let's let's do that one. We can change the talent. Remember that you can change your talent whenever you want, as long as you are here in a rested area. You have to be in a rested area. For example, right now, I cannot change it. See? You must be in a, in a rest area to change talents. Let's go and do a little bit of questing. Just a little bit. One more quest over here. And then we end the episode. Doing one or two quests over here. And then we're ending the episode. Actually, level 45. Level 45, we can already go to the other zone. To this one. Okay, next episode. Okay? Next episode is going to be... New episode, new leveling zone. We're going to move to another leveling zone. Seems good? Yeah, nice. Collect 8 scoops. Okay, let's go. Um, another quest you have for me? This one? Alright, so, uh, 10 scoops and then dead employees hooked. We have to hook. Where are the dead employees? Employees. Okay, that one is a dead employee over there, I guess. Why are they dead, though? <laughs> Who killed them? Wait, what? I thought I hook them and I have to bring them there. But apparently a hook appears out of nowhere and hooks them. Okay, then. Seems good. See how the the tiger palm the tiger palm generate two key over there? And right now again. 15 seconds is very low time. Like 15 seconds is basically every second or third Tiger Palm, and it generates two key instead of only one. It is, too it is really good choice. You will see that it's really good choice of a, of a talent. I am out of range. It it won't make a huge difference when we are killing these mobs because they are very easy to kill anyways, no matter what. But uh, in dungeons and battlegrounds, it, it will make a difference. It's basically... One extra key is basically one extra blackout kick every time. And that basically means it's extra, like, 900 damage. 
Now, if we get the critical strike, it's a lot more than that. Critical strike is double the damage, right? Alright, this away. one, this guy, yeah, these mobs are green, we are level 45 and this mob is level 40, so they are green right now, and they don't give us that much experience, so we're definitely moving to another zone, in the next episode we're doing for, we're, we're moving to the other leveling zone. They made it so you level up faster. And that's pretty cool. But at the same time you switch zones so often. Yeah, I guess a lot of people don't really enjoy leveling. Watching another person level might be entertaining for you guys. But leveling yourself, a lot of people tell me... How do I level up very fast? I don't want to do it forever. It's very boring. I don't have fun leveling. I want to be level 110 and then do and then do 110 shenanigans. And then do lev maximum level shenanigans. Well, you do level up quite fast. There are probably wave ways to speed up the leveling even more but I don't really know maybe some kind of potions that people sell somewhere that will give you extra experience you can if you want to level up very very fast you can try to google another two quests damn man you are giving me a lot of quests here but I'm not going to do these quests because we are going to log out and that is the end of the episode. I'm gonna go to the boat. I don't want to log out here in the water. I want to log out in the rest area. So the next time we log in, tomorrow, we're going to have blue experience which will be 200% experience gained only for the blue one. We're gonna be gaining experience faster and stuff. Let's go in here. Fly. And now torpedo. Another torpedo. Okay, this is the rest area. Actually, the entire boat is rest area. As you can see, the Z's on my character here. Instead of the level. So, everywhere is a rested area. Did I log out? What happened? Yeah, I logged out. So that was it for this episode, episode 15. Thank you guys for watching. This is my main over here. What's up? Um, thank you guys for watching. A like on the video would be really appreciated as always. If you're new to my channel, feel free to subscribe. Thank you for watching again and I will see you in the next episode. Good luck and have fun playing video games.